welcome everyone. Today we will be talking to Heidi Kwok, the founder of Graceful Hands, about why it is so important for parents to learn English in Hong Kong. The topic we are going to discuss today is spelling. Hi Heidi, um, can you please tell um, the parents why learning to spell is so important? Okay. Actually, parents are important spelling teachers who play a very active role in shaping both their children's attitudes about spelling as well as their spelling skills. In order to be most supportive in helping the children learn to spell, it is important that parents understand the following beliefs about how children develop spelling ability. Just as phonics is one aspect of reading, Spelling is one aspect of writing. Therefore, it cannot be seen as an isolated skill, but rather as a part of the total writing process. Children need to learn to spell the words that they need in their writing. Actually, good phonics program can help the young ones to be good readers and very good spellers. Parents should learn more about the aims of different phonics programs and choose a suitable one to fit with your task. Very good. So can you also please tell us about um, how can parents help their children with spelling? Okay. Um, actually, good spellers are usually good readers and also good speakers and vice versa. Using the school or local library helps your child develop some of these skills. Restrict the amount of TV he watches. Your child cannot talk back to a TV set, right? Give your child the opportunity to talk with you. Uh, like trace words is one other way. This activity helps many children. Have your child sit next to you or, if very young, sit on your lap. Sit so that you can guide his writing hand and uh, print or write a word that is confusing to them. If your child is working on a class spelling list and can only remember half of the words, speak to the teacher. Actually, teachers are more than delighted to hear how their students respond to homework. Perhaps the list can be reduced so that your child has fewer words and can learn this more efficiently and comfortably. And don't tackle an entire spelling list in one sitting. Take one third, for example, each evening to work on with your child. Break the practice into small units, like try 15 minutes of review uh, when he gets home, another 15 minutes before supper, and another 15 minutes after supper. Actually, shorter periods are more effective than one massive review. Long spelling may sometimes exhaust and frustrate children. Very good advice. So please tell us something about like um, how can the parents make spelling more interesting for their kids? Okay, actually many parents have their kids practice spelling words by uh, reciting them out loud or writing them over and over again, but they will get bored quickly. So how can you make spelling practice a little bit more fun for your child? Um, make a fun songs to teach the spelling of words while you are riding in a car, for example. Uh, we can use the tune of B-I-N-G-O Bingo and make up like uh, M-A-P-L-E Maple or T-A-B-L-E Table. These games are fun for kids. Actually play games like um, Handman, using a spelling word or mix spelling word bingo cards. Parents could make a bingo card with the spelling words so the kids can help and let them be the bingo master in some family place. This way, can ha uh, they can uh, have both writing and reading skill developed. And uh, they will enjoy it. In this case, everyone wins. Very good. Thank you, Heidi, for telling us how to learn to spell well is important. Mm. We look forward to hearing from you soon. Thank you so much. Thank Bye. you. Thank you.